What up, peeps, and welcome back to another episode. I've been working on the car today, so let me catch you up on what's been going on. So as you can see, I got most of it all together already. Headers are in. Some of the hoses are on. I had to cut the dizzy, one of the butterflies, one of the pieces to like the, you know, the things that bolt in anyways, you know what I'm talking about. So I can try to see if I could crank it with this dizzy and start it. I mean, I'm going to eventually get the right one for it, a, a VTEC distributor. This is from a B20. Well, actually, I don't even know what this is from. I, I had the B21, so I just swapped out the internals and put it in this one that plugged right into my harness. So it doesn't really hold up too well, so I'm just gonna, <laughs> gonna wing it like this. Uh, seems pretty stable, so if it flies off, whatever. I also had trouble with my injectors. The These plugs did not plug into them. So good thing I have a ton of injectors in here everywhere. So I found a set that fit in there and plugged up fine. Um, what else? I got oil. I put the alternator in. There's no belt on it though. Hopefully it'll start and stay on for a little bit. The starter's in. Brand new starter. And uh, let's see what happens. I did have a fuel leak. I primed it before I ran home to grab the phone. It was leaking from here, so I put like a rubber bushing looking thing there, and it stopped leaking. But it's leaking a little bit out of this crush washer right here. So like a really, really little, little bit. It's not even dropping. It's just like, like you can see air and a little moisturizer getting out. So I'm going to try to crank it today. I'm going to put oil in it, and then I'll get back to recording. I'll put the phone somewhere, so I haven't even started it yet. I still have to plug this up and you know i was just making sure everything was tight bolted up all the clips were in the right spot um it's gonna be loud though because i only have the header piece up to here and remember i'm not gonna start this and leave it running i'm just gonna see if it turns on hopefully i don't hear no rod knocks or nothing because i didn't even check the block when i put it together so this is gonna be interesting so here we go well i don't know if you can hear me i probably have to yell but this is my first time trying to crank it. Oh, before I even crank it, I forgot to plug up a little hole inside the manifold. One second. Well, I am scared shitless. Um, I, I don't know if this is going to start or if it's going to blow up. <laughs> so... Okay. Let's plug. Boom, 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 boom. I am so scared. I'm gonna have 911 on speed dial on my cell phone. Fingers crossed. I'm so, I'm so fucking scared. Let me just make sure the fan's not tangling up with a with a wire or something. I'm sorry for that winding noise in the background. I don't see anything. Looks good. See what happens. Okay, nothing happened. I don't know if I didn't plug something up right, but I'm gonna check it out. Okay, I figured it out, I think. Um, one of the, the starter clips came out. There's only one wire with a bolt that goes down and one with a, one that slides in like a little pin thing. So it came out when I, when I was looking over there, it wasn't in. But now it's in and Let's try this again. Where the hell's my phone? I'm a, nerv I'm a nervous wreck right now. I just hope the damper doesn't fly off or some crazy shit happens. Am 
Might be the dizzy that's not letting to start, which I'm like 100% sure. So I'm gonna have to try to find a position for it. I moved the ignition a little bit, let's try it again. Sorry for that person getting involved in the camera, but let's do this again. Porque cuando, cuando prenden, a veces cogen un diente. Okay, I'm done playing with it. Um, it's kind of jamming up with the dizzy because the rotor inside is, is like kind of grinding down the cap, the little metal pieces inside the cap. So I'm just going to find the VTEC dizzy. At least I know it starts. So I'm happy. I was scared, but happy. Well, it starts. Um, I'm sorry about that guy that kept getting in the way. That's... um. That's my cousin's brother-in-law or something like that. And we were speaking Spanish, if you were wondering. He was just saying that if it was off timing, I said it's not off timing. It's just that the distributor's not for it, you know? But I, I can't believe I got it started. I was a nervous wreck trying to start that thing, as you can see. And I don't want to drive and record, so let me stop here real quick. But um, it started. I'm excited, and I want to thank you guys for joining me and me sharing this with you guys so thank you very much and tomorrow i'm gonna start putting my bumper together well like it's, it's just a bumper you don't put it together but i'm gonna put my bumper on and just put everything on that's missing and find some axles but i do have to find that distributor i'm gonna price it at autozone if not ebay ebay for the win so thanks for watching like share subscribe if you're not subscribed and i'll see you on the next one peace